Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the American Optical AO1002 sunglasses. So first off, let's go ahead and pop these sunglasses on face and talk about the dimensions. These sunglasses have 51 millimeter lenses and a 19 millimeter bridge. And these sunglasses definitely have a classic round metal style to them. And American Optical just recently brought these sunglasses back. So I actually do have a pair of the original Ray-Ban round metal sunglasses to show you guys here in comparison, these sunglasses are the standard size and these have a little bit smaller lenses. These have 50 millimeter lenses. So let's go ahead and pop on the original Ray-Ban uh, round sunglasses. Here we can see they definitely look very similar uh, to each other. The Ray-Ban uh, round metal are going to have some etchings here on the frames. Where the American Optical don't have any etchings, they look very similar to the American Optical original pilot sunglasses. So right now I have on the original Ray-Ban round metal sunglasses. Now we go ahead and pop back on the American Optical to show you guys how those look like. And here we can see they look very similar to each other. These sunglasses have very cool looking gray gradient lenses. So here up at the top, we can see they're much darker than here at the bottom. And that adds a really cool look to these frames. Now these frames actually have nylon lenses versus the all glass lenses found in a pair of Ray-Ban uh, round metal sunglasses. Nylon are going to be much lighter weight than all glass lenses, but the optical clarity of nylon isn't going to be quite as good as all glass lenses. As of when filming this video, American Optical isn't producing these with all glass lenses, but they might do that in the future. I really don't know. I probably expect them to do that, but again, I have no way of knowing if they are going to or if they're not going to, but I would really like to see a pair of these sunglasses with all glass lenses. I think that really uh, makes the sunglasses feel more vintage if they do have glass lenses because nylon lenses didn't exist back in the 1950s and 60s when these were extremely popular. Now these sunglasses have very nice and premium all metal frames and they also have very nice all metal hinges which feel very good when opening up and when closing them. They also have very very nice and beefy hinges, much better hinges than found on those pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses. They just are very beefy and substantial. These have the same style hinge that is found on the American Optical original pilot sunglasses which is really nice to see. Now taking a look at the outside temple sunglasses we can see a little AO logo on both the left and the right hand side of the frame and then also on the top left corner of the lens we can see a little AO logo for authentication purposes. These sunglasses also have very nice and premium uh, acetate ear rests which feel really good behind the ear and they also look really nice as well. They just feel very good when you just slide the sunglasses on face and they're going to help uh, sunglasses fit the face very well which is really cool to see. These sunglasses also have fully adjustable nose rest so you can completely adjust these sunglasses to your liking and again because they do have those nylon lenses they are extremely lightweight so you can wear the sunglasses all day long without any discomfort. Now as far as coverage from the sun goes unfortunately because these are a round style they're not going to have very good coverage at all so here up top we can see there is definitely a pretty big gap to let sunlight in unprotected and then here on the side again there is a really big gap to let sunlight in unprotected but these sunglasses also have a very nice anti-reflective material which is going to help reduce sunlight coming in and bouncing off the lens at an angle directly into your eye, which is really nice to see, especially on a pair of round metal sunglasses that aren't going to offer the best coverage. Now, as far as pricing goes, these sunglasses are definitely priced competitively. They're going to come in at around $189, so not much more than the Ray-Bans cost, and you're getting all the heritage that comes with a pair of American Optical sunglasses, which is really cool. And for current pricing and availability, I'm going to leave a link in the description down below. You guys can check out these sunglasses on Amazon for usually the best price. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to hit the subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I put a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.